but we're talking about the traffic in the skies and on the roads. Rhode Island, southeastern Massachusetts, all of the U.S. getting ready to hit the road for this weekend. A lot of people coming here, of course. This is the time of year people come to visit. Now a live look over a popular traffic route to the beach, Route 4 at Route 1 from the RIDOT pinpoint traffic camera. Millions of people are either flying or driving this holiday weekend. And 12 News reporter Matt Paddock is digging into the predicted travel numbers. We're hearing records are likely to be broken today, Matt. Yeah, exactly, Kate. Holiday travel is already underway across New England as AAA protects rec record numbers on both our roads and in the skies. Now, according to AAA, more than 4 million Americans are expected to take to the skies this weekend, an 11% increase from their pre-pandemic record-breaking weekend in 2019. Mark Shieldrop tells me that international travel is up 400% this year. And when it comes to those taking to the roads, AAA is estimating 50 million Americans will be traveling 50 miles or more this weekend. Shield Drop says for those looking to gas up and hit the road, the busiest hours of travel will be tonight from 4 to 8. Warning to travelers to pack their patience, plan for delays, and take your time on the roadways. New England's going to be busy all around. We know those areas that tend to get jammed up when there's a lot of traffic. You know, the 93-95 interchange, for example, the bridges to Cape Cod, uh, 195 in and out of uh, Providence. Those are those bottleneck spots. So when folks just know that, hey, it's going to be busy out there, just having that mindset often is the best tool you have. And coming up tonight on WPRI 12, we're going to be talking to you, the viewers, those that are doing some traveling over the holiday weekend. But reporting live in Warwick, Matt Paddock, 12 News.